Hey, God bless you. So this one is on truth, the left, and um, false accusers. So uh, a lefty came up and started talking to me the other day. And um, wow, it was, she actually said truth doesn't matter. Because she's having issues with something and I'm having issues with the th same thing. And initially on that topic, she was like, well, you shouldn't have to deal with this. And we really need to stick together. And mind you, I've never met the woman before. <laughs> she just came up and started talking to me. And um, she's like, well, I'm not a lawyer, but I'll pretend to be one. I'll go with you. I'm like, interesting. And then we were, she kept on talking and she saw um, something of mine that is not in the best repair and needs help. She's like, you need to go get that fixed and you shouldn't pay for it. And just tell them anything. Just, you know, they'll pay for it. Just tell me you have five kids and they'll pay for it. And I'm just like, eh, really? I didn't know about that one. And she was just, she literally said, truth does not matter. I was like, wow. Which I was like, um, I'd have to disagree with you. I, I think truth does matter. So the look on her face was just like, what the... Um, I don't know it was more fun seeing her look when I said truth matters or when I said well God bless you with peace with all your trials um, Wow, but yeah, she actually said truth does not matter You just do and say whatever Whatever to get what you want. I Wish I could say this was just a fluke, but the left party has proven this time and again do whatever, say whatever. I mean, how many politicians do we have recorded who tell business owners, oh, I have what I say publicly isn't what I will do once I get in office. I mean, we had, what was it, Nancy Pelosi? Oh, well, we can't tell you what's in the bill, but if you pass it, then we can tell you. It doesn't work that way. What are you talking about? Their absolute disregard for transparency for truth is really alarming and I wish I because I saw something and there was this black liberal that he, and he was all like well I'm I'm a Democrat but I'm not a modern Democrat the modern Democrats are very fascist they don't care about justice they don't care about facts and um, I, I, I have to seriously disagree because when you look over the last 200 plus years the left time and again lie about anything and everything and when you disagree with them they go violent on you they will first name call you shout you out um bully you and then if that doesn't work um they turn to violence we have one thing after another from slavery to kkk to welfare from mass incarceration to um antifa now it's been one long, oh, incessant, just drama with the left. It's like the cycle really needs to end. And um, and I saw that there is someone who came against Kavanaugh is now saying that she was lying. Um, which again, it's the left. They didn't want. They hate Trump. I mean, we have Maxine Water who is calling for violence against people who disagree with the left, she's resisting. No, you're refusing to do your job. She has done nothing. Well, she's never done nothing, but she's really has ramped up not doing anything and being completely worthless the last two years. Um, and it's this left mentality of do whatever to get our way, which false, accuser, false accusers, especially on serious crimes, they should be punished double. They really should. They should be punished for giving false witness. And then they should be punished for the damage they do to actual victims. Because for some reason, people just never want to hold men accountable. They want to make excuse after excuse, whether it's small or big. It just doesn't matter. It's the disrespect so many men have and people's willingness to ignore it and look the other way and endanger females is so alarming. It's frustrating beyond belief. And when you need help and you need justice, you can't get it because a handful of numbnuts have lied. 
or it makes it even more difficult because people do not want to deal on this topic, which just endangers us. Um, but yeah, you false accusers, you are as bad as the predator because the predator robs the victim of so many things. It is a not just an attack on the person, it's an attack within the person. They are robbed of so many things. And when you make false accusations, you're robbing them of any chance to have any justice, which is already oh so slight. You're a thief, just like the predator. If you want to support victims, well, when people are making excuses, say, no, I don't buy into excuses. When people, like, speak up and say, I believe her. Or she could be telling the truth. That's how you support someone, by refraining from name-calling them. By refraining from thinking the absolute worst of the woman immediately. Stop making excuses for predators. That's how, that's how you promote support, not lying. Lying robs the victim even more. You victimize the victim to a whole new extent. You're creeps. Absolute creeps. I hope you all get out and vote anything but left. And I say left because, you know, there's little parties that are um, not democratic but are definitely left. So just vote anything but left. It would be so nice to get a handle on this nation. We need to get back to our roots because when you cut yourself off from your roots, you die. Has anyone ever read that book, When Nations Die? It reviews the uh, like really huge nations of the past and what happened from their great ascent to their great fall. It's a fascinating book. So, yeah, you cut yourself off from your roots and you, you die. Alrighty then. God bless.